seven, we did the mermaid, and I'm so glad it turned out really cool. And、uh, okay, so let me start with hers. Um, India's.、Uh, this one is not as clear. Actually, it was, was a little bit clear. So, I love this one. I I'm glad it worked out really pretty, and、um, her <laughs> the face is perfect. I was so afraid, you guys, my like make the face really funny, but but no, India's the face turned out so pretty. And everything looks super cute. The arms, I wouldn't worry about the arms. It looks fine. Looks just this is just how it should look. A little bit chubby, but <laughs> it's very cute. And all these little details, I love your details. And the color schemes are pretty.、Um, I think. I think India was not mixing colors enough. So, like last、uh, on week seven, I wanted you guys to practice more mixing with mixing color. I think she did a little bit here. I was, I am taking screenshots of it. But、um, yeah. Anyways, so next time,、um, just be a little bit more adventurous. Try something new you have not. Done before, you will be surprised with the outcome. So I am so happy to see her hair. <laughs> It's this is very creative. Like she had pink here, and then she had blue in the back, and the fence looks very nice. Like I was seeing it in the、um, video, and it just looks incredible. So I'm glad she's <clears throat> having a lot of fun. So. This one is Callie's, and <laughs> no, it's amazing. Okay, so <clears throat> I love how she did these gradients. These are amazing. Look at that; it's just so pretty. Okay, I have to change the color to white. So these are just very, very pretty. I love all these gradient details. Like, ah,、oh, this is amazing. So yeah, <clears throat> so every week I try to have. A different thing that I want you guys to explore. So that week was the color that we were trying out, and I like her idea of the rainbow hair. It's really cool, and she just tangled them up like that. So I love it, and just so Kelly's very good with colors. She always have、um, amazing. Color schemes. It's very designer, um, designer ish, and yeah, I am very happy to see her trying new things all the time. And these looks amazing too. All these lines that makes um the the fins look incredibly like detailed. So. I like it. I think you guys had a lot of fun this week. I'm glad, and I like the color that she have here too. I don't know why she's having wrinkles on her belly, but I I think she probably overdid her body and it was just kind of getting wrinkler.、Um, but it's okay. Yeah, that's you don't have to be perfect at this age. And I love her, her the pattern that she has on the fin. On on the tail. Okay, let's see. This is Vera's. So yeah, Vera um had the primary color ones, but she's mixing other colors, which is fine. Oh, I love her skin color. So she was mixing skin color on her own. It took a while, but it looks good. It looks like she is very um her skin looks very normal, and she had extra. Orange and the colors looks nice. I would hope、um, we can do more more details with tools instead of dots. So this looks too simple. Like I I have high expectations, you know, you know. So yeah, but I mean she's working with a different clay that. We have so I, I don't really know how that clay works with、um, the tools. So, yeah,、uh, I think 
this is very pretty i am so glad you guys all have fantastic mermaids super pretty we are at week eight and i will share with you what india did this week first since she requests she wants to be the first one and um i really like hers i think it's very creative i love this part okay let me show you i love that she have this right here it's so pretty wow so i like that part i like the rainbow part but i am hoping okay so this is amazing i love the red gradient and the orange gradient that's very pretty i love what she have for the buttons as well and this very very cool box right here so very fancy oh you know i i really like the yellow i think yellow matches with these colors very nicely and she has this very cute um seagull and this is a cleaning h e n t cleaning what uh i'm not sure okay so i love um the animals she has and she even has shadows so that's very nice um uh, let me see what other things i think she could have done um i think she could have have a little bit of sand color but um, someone was seems like she's getting tired but oh I, I actually like your clouds okay but um these are they look like they are mountains so next time i would suggest um maybe doing it that way a little bit more like this i uh, actually yeah i think she did it in the back but I'm, I'm not sure why these are like suddenly really really tall like that oh but yeah anyways like this is perfect like that one's really really pretty like this one i think it has too much of a hill i think if you have a little bit of jump here it will look a little bit more natural or something like this so don't do like the don't do the obvious jump like this one makes it look like it's part of a mountain so just kind of pay attention to that and um for the oil spill i would suggest like if she have it here i would suggest having a boat maybe there or like um or i guess like it it's kind of it actually spreads out like that it would not be like this this one looks more like like a shadow of something so the oil tend to spread out like towards this way and that way so yeah just kind of paying more attention um and um i like it very nice um i like the shadows that she have but uh and the crap <laughs> the very cute crap so very pretty nice oh yeah, yeah. Um, i just want to say um i am very very proud of your gradients now it's amazing like look at the ocean there so pretty so very very nice job and let's move on to vera's so vera is a little bit younger she, i am hoping that she can um just draw slower seems like she's rushing through a lot of things i know i know i know color pencil is a little bit harder to control like it's just more work but um like if you do master it it's going to be so good for you down the road like like so just go slower with um color pencil and just take your time um don't need to rush just i i'm sure she did she um drew and color all of this really really like um detailed so i think she probably got tired of after that but this one looks very nice i like it i think she put a lot of thought into it but um she like okay like right now it doesn't look like 
I cannot really see things unless you outline. So that's the that's the like sad part about it. Um, with some of the artwork, if you don't go back and outline things, some things will disappear. Like I think this is a red hat, but it kind of disappear without the outline. So. But if you are just trying out your ideas, this is fine. Um, I, I I was asking her about this, and she had that. Okay, so I think Vera could do a little bit better, but I think she's probably tired. Uh, it's very cute, anyways. I like the idea. She's the only one who has a whale idea inside a fish tank. With the shower head, <laughs> so that's very cute. And she is the only one who has the flying airplane with um a mechanism that sucks up the oil spill. So you know, I am very very surprised with Vera's idea. I think she's a thinker, and she has a lot of ideas that is super great. But um, you know, this is art class. I do hope. This could be color, if possible. Vera, I am. I have high expectations from you. So, anyways, so if that would be, it would look so cute if it's a pink airplane. <laughs> okay, and no passing. This sign um should be color, and this little guy could have been a little bit. Uh, I mean, he could have have a friend.、Uh, I have no clue why she put the step in the sand. So, but but overall, overall, it's nice. Okay, so I only have two because I think other people are busy this week. Um, but、uh, they also did a very nice job. So I just wanna say, like, you guys are brilliant. I have no ideas how many, how many um I have no clue how many ideas you guys have, and I'm so proud of you guys. Okay, so I'll see you guys this week with painting. Bye.